You're not gonna believe this. They shot the driver. They stole goods that worth millions and millions of rents, but they took everything laptops, gadgets, all of them. Hold it. We found this few meters away from here. Well, I can say poor Magalao, a cabello driver. Open cello machining a man chicago. Bastard. A gun number. Don't fund. You can't go on off accusing people without proof or evidence. How many people must this man kill before we actually arrest him? Hey, la detective Sibulai. We don't work with rumors here. We work with proof and evidence. If you don't have one of those, Fundo is off. If you know what is good for your job. What's going on here, gentlemen? Michael Mfundo, you're under arrest for theft, murder, and robbery. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. Justice will always be safe. Neo. Don't worry, Michael. I'll get you out. Constable. Damn it, let's go. Neo. I'd just like to ask you a few questions regarding the death of Mfundo Michael. So, as the lawyer said, Mfundo Michael's will states that all his assets should be left to you. Is it true that you framed him, tampered with the evidence, and murdered him? But a man with sins like his deserves death. Yeah,
You know, Asanda, she doesn't even deserve to be CEO of Pakate Holdings. What does she even know about, about running a business? Huh? Absolutely nothing. You know, for years, John, I worked so hard in building up that family business. I put blood, sweat, tears into making it the empire that it is today. And now they want to appoint my sister as CEO. How? Oh, I'll help you with that one. Your father appointed you COO of the company. But just because when diggers and Yanamulelo, he squandered money from the company. Your father's company. That's ancient history, John. My father had already forgiven. Oh, clearly the board hasn't. Oh, what do you know about the board? No, I don't even try and make an excuse for that one. You stole from the man who took you in, brought you up and loved you like his own flesh and blood. Come on, Amanda. Things could have been different had you not done that. Oh, please. You're just bitter because your wife gets to be your boss, not the other way around. So do me a favor, John. And kill that bitch. Do it right this time. Okay. Okay. Okay, fine. Look, I'll sort everything out. Everything will be as it should be. You and I will assume our positions in the company. So just calm down, relax, and pour me a drink. Oh, you always just say my signature is untidy. <laughs> to freedom. To freedom, champ. Mama, what's that? You're under arrest for the murder of Mr. Matlogo. You're not supposed to touch me. That's my lawyer. <laughs> Judas Kiss, Sundays at 7.30 only on SABC One. We make sure.